Hello, I'm Annette Kinsey from Lunar Jewelry and welcome to our March video news. This month we're going to be highlighting all kinds of newness for the month with the beginning of the beauty of the spring season. We're so excited about our new Pieces for Spring from Ed Levin. And with each piece they have a unique style element um, from the design of the earrings to the pendants and each of the earrings that we've selected has a beauty of its own with the way that the um, stones are set on the earrings and also be a, being able to enjoy the design from the side of the ear to the front because with the gentle curve the length of the earring it's just beautiful on the ear and each one is unique in the way, in the offering that it displays this particular earring has the pendulum swing. It's beautiful in that it is very simple, and yet the structure and the design of the earring is completely different than what we usually see. With this earring, we have the openness at the base of the earring and the combination of the texture with the high polish. So again, a unique design that's very simple and also very functional. And then we have the design element of the combination of the rose with the sterling silver. It gives it a beautiful touch with the rose, just the soft pink against the sterling silver. The earring itself is very simple, and yet would you, when you put the combination together, it makes it a stunning earring. And then this pendant, I think is absolutely awesome because it's got the elongated, again, just the slight curves make the pendant so unique. And then the element, which it has a uh, separate piece of the rose that dangles alongside the piece. So beautiful, simple, and yet very unique and stunning. We have some fun Pandora themes for spring that are all about expressing your personality, telling your individual story, and yet grouped together either in colors or an idea. So we have the dreamer, which this one is like a cosmic theme. Um, so it's got some moons and some stars and the blue colors. We have this one, which is called the queen. And with the queen, of course, a lot of gold and a lot of the bling of the um, crystals in the bracelet itself combined with the sterling silver. Then we have the Lady Boss, which is showing um, kind of a girl's night out and also the idea of a working female. So we've got the lipstick themes, the stiletto um, shoe, and a touch of the red. Very fun. And then we have the Adventurer, which is probably one of everybody's favorites because it's all about travel and adventure, um, putting together some of the nautical themes. So just some fun ideas for spring from Pandora, combining some of their, um, all of their elements together to make very fun and festive bracelets. As the home basketball season comes to an end, we look forward to tournament time. So we've got the Big 12 tournament coming up and then the big dance following that. So lots of excitement for March Madness. We wanna highlight some of our OSU jewelry in our basketball charms. So we have our enamel OSU charm. This one is great because it can be worn on a bracelet or it can also be put on a chain to wear as a necklace. So you can go either way with this particular basketball charm. We have the pearl bracelet. We like to think of these as basketballs with the orange crystals. So we have the pearl bracelet with the orange dangle. We have the matching stud earrings. Then we have our basketball pendant here also with the touch of the bling. And then we have our crystal rings in the orange, clear, and black, which we love because you can do so much playing with them, um, stacking them in different color combinations, mixing them with other patterns and uh, rings. So, so much fun with those. And then also um, the ones here that are the jackets. So you combine the stud with the little jacket that comes underneath. So you've got the orange and crystal bling earrings. We're going to bounce from basketball to diamonds and we're going to be talking about a ring with a classic style 
that is making a big comeback um, and because of its versatility, it offers us so many different options. It is the ring guard, which again is available, as you can see, in the yellow gold, the white gold. There's all different kinds of styles of the ring guards. And in this particular one, we see the shape here in the center, which allows for a shape of diamond, whether it be round, pear shape, marquees, uh, princess cut that will sit into the center of the ring guard. Now the beauty of it is, again, it makes a gorgeous statement when it is all complete, and yet you have the versatility of wearing the solitaire by itself, or with the ring guard you could combine it with a colored gemstone, a pearl, so again you just have unlimited options, but once you put it together, wow what a statement it makes. Also with this particular ring guard, um, because this one has a straight across, it's beautiful to be worn with like a diamond anniversary band. And again, when you slide it in, you get the wow factor because it makes it look like a whole different ring. And again, you have the versatility of being able to wear the ring guard out or in the ring itself. And then one other style that I have selected is with this one with a diamond halo. So again, you've got a lot of detail, which this one makes a very regal looking ring um, as you slide the diamond halo in. And you have the accentuation of the rose gold against the white gold. So a classic that is making a comeback for a great reason because it just lot offers lots of versatility and style options. Another fashion staple and classic that is making a huge comeback is the diamond three stone. And it's symbolic because with the three stones it stands for your past, your present, and your future. So being a symbolic ring it is always in style and always in fashion. Um, but with the recent engagement of Meghan Markle to Prince Harry, there is a lots of emphasis on the three stones because that is what he chose to give to his um, bride-to-be. So a lot of excitement about the three stones. And again, with the beauty of it, the diamonds can be, as in this band, all the same size. You can have it as in we see in the princess cut where you've got graduated sizes, and this one has the diamond accents on the side of the ring itself. Or again, the classic beauty of the different graduated sizes. This one having a little bit of a dip in the sides with the cathedral mounting in the yellow gold. So each of them can be a little bit different. You can get a personality and a flavor to each ring. But again, very much a fashion staple and yet making a huge comeback as a symbolic ring of love. We absolutely love the one-of-a-kind gemstone creations because each one can be so individual and each gemstone itself can tell its own story. So we love the, the idea of this one which has this incredible chain. So you get the element of the long oval chain with the small chain, the asymmetry on the side of the designs with the small gemstones, and then you had the azurite malachite gemstone that is here as the center of attention. And with a long chain like that, which is very popular right now to wear the really elongated styles, you also have the option of doubling the chain or you can just shorten it by attaching it um, to a shorter length in the back. And then the pendant itself is also detachable so you can take it off, wear the chain with the side gemstones by themselves, or this can be worn on a shorter necklace if you want a completely different look. So again, the option of being able to detach the pendant makes it great for giving you styling options with different necklines. This particular pendant, which is gorgeous in the um, purples, and this is an amethyst, and with the amethyst you get a combination of the light lavender, with the deep purple and then also a touch of the black. Accentuated again with a long chain of the black um, rhodium on the chain itself. And again, the asymmetry of the side amethyst in the faceted on the side. So it's a beautiful combination and the particular shape of the stone is very, very unique. 
with this one, which we love the soft color of the blue violet. This particular one is a chalcedony. Again, a detachable piece. You also have the asymmetry of the um, side gemstones. Again, the different links in the chain or options of links in the chain. You can see the beauty of the druzy on the front and then the smoothness of the stone on the back. Again, a detachable piece but the soft color is gorgeous. And then one of our favorites are the slices of the aquamarines. With this, we get the combination of the yellow mixed in with the sterling. This one being a shorter necklace because it is a statement to be worn at the nape of the neck since you want all of the emphasis on the aquamarine gemstones. And our news about March would not be complete without talking about the birthstone for March, which is the lovely aquamarine. Aquamarine meaning sea water, so it is a very pale color. Um, and the, the beauty of it is in the softness, the subtlety of the gemstone. And yet we see variations from a light pale blue um, to a touch of the green, which again, the sea water we see in nature itself. So we've chosen some of our favorite styles um, because the aquamarine shows the pale blue when it's accentuated with the diamonds as we see in the halo style of the diamond stud earrings. Then we have the beauty of the emerald cup pendant, which again, classic and simple, but showing the beautiful um, rich blue. And then we have the two stone ring, which again, we talk about better together, um, one for friendship, one for love, or just the beauty of the two stones combined um, as just a design element. We have the solitaire here. This particular aquamarine is one that we created, um, but it has a touch more of the green, which some people love because it just is different and then just an absolutely outstanding piece in the aquamarine with the halo. It has the beauty of the side diamonds um, with the shaping and the design. This one is a very large aquamarine and is a stunning color. Thank you for joining us for our March video news. We hope you found some jewelry that you love. If you have any questions or comments, please let us know. You can see our jewelry online at leonardjewelry.com and we hope you have a very blessed March.